society today, you know, that's all we seem to do is sit. We're very good at sitting. We wake up from lying down, and then uh, we have our breakfast while sitting, and then we get in the car and sit, go to work, uh, sit and work, and type in, and then we come home because we're tired from sitting, um, and then we lie down. And that's our daily process. Um, but that's not what we're made for. We have arms and legs, um, we have the will and the want to move. There's something in our DNA, we all know it, we all feel it, and we get depressed when we don't do it. We don't necessarily understand the process of why we're feeling depressed, but there's something innate in all of us that makes us want to move. So, you know, it, it's, it answers all the questions, really. Hi guys, I'm Mike Newman. Uh, I'm the, the director of Release the Movement, um, and the man behind everything you see for you. My background, I've got um, an extensive background in martial arts and boxing. I did four, boxing for four years, two years of which was coaching. Um, then I got into uh, mixed martial arts, predominantly Kempo, um, but something something was always still missing. Uh, I'm not really much of a, I, I don't really want to fight people, although it was it was for the, the sake of um, self-defense more than anything, but um, no, I'd prefer to like jump around and have fun. Yes, my background definitely influences the way I got into parkour free running and the way I move. Yeah, 100%. For me, I'm, I'm 32 now, so I'm getting on a bit and I, for me, when I do free running, when I'm doing it, life slows down. Because at the moment, life's so fast. Everything's going so quick. The weeks turn into months. It just all convenes together so fast. But when I'm doing parkour, everything slows down. Everything goes black and white for me, and it's, it's a calming thing for me. I want Release the Movement to open people's minds. Um, at the moment, in terms of competition and sport and arts, movement arts, um, there seems to be these barriers. Oh, it's an art. Oh, it's a competition. It's a sport. Um, there isn't really boundaries. It's all movement. It doesn't matter what you're doing. Be it rugby, be it, be it free running, be it street dance. Um, this is to celebrate all movement um, and autonomous movement where you can connect your movements together, your skills together. I'm 18 and I'm an urban brick toucher. I'm Connor Mills, I'm 16 and I'm a free runner. I've kind of got a healthier lifestyle now, so. I have been done. <laughs> I have literally lost about a third of my body fat doing this. I went from like one of the fattest kids in my year to probably one of the skinniest ones now, so it's just evolved me. Take this up, you'll enjoy it. I'm Sam Jones, I'm 17 and I do free running. Where I come from, Merthyr, there's not a lot of people that do it. Um, I think I'm the only one that really trains around me. So it was quite hard, I just watched things on the computer. And then um, I came to Cardiff one day and I met all the guys and just went from there. It's affected me in a positive way because I wouldn't be as active as I am. Um, I wouldn't have as many friends as I do. And I wouldn't see as many things as I do see. Great dancers, they do like so much uh, flowy stuff, and I think I'll definitely incorporate that into what I do now, yeah. My name is Glenn Bevan, I'm currently coach at uh, Kinetics, teaching parkour and I'm 23 years of old age. My name is Alan Golden, I'm a performer for Kinetics Wales and I'm 18 years old. Sports, my background is, um, I didn't actually like sports until I got into doing parkour and uh, I just found that it was a freedom, I didn't have to, I wasn't meant to do it every day and I didn't have to pay, I could go out and do it whenever I wanted so that was fun. Well, I come, when I grew up, I was in a number of sports, played football and rugby. I never really found an interest. And uh, after a while of not really doing much, done a lot of sitting around, I uh, come across a few boys that done parkour and slowly just got into it as a group of mates. 
benefit wise this, uh, this opened up a whole new lot of doors and seeing that you're not stuck to the rules that the people put in charge where you have to stick to the footpaths and the uh, railings and that we can just create art and jump around and jump over it and be fluid. Uh, I guess it's sort of opened up a new state of mind like I look at everything different now I see a different way if, it, if it's telling me to go away, I prefer to take the wrong way, not the right. It teaches you to see the energy that comes off the rails and the walls and people are like, oh, yeah, we've got to stick this side, but we'd see the flow and the energy that we can boost from just jumping on that wall and doing a little tap boat or something. Hopefully it opens up people's eyes to um, different movements because as it's a competition, but it's like it's a friendly competition. And so with release movement, it should open up uh, younger kids and other adults to get into movement and not find that you have to go to a gym and lift weights you can just learn to lift your own body weight and be free at the same time when i started i was 16 stone i'm now a good standard 11 stone and movement is just brilliant I'm uh, 18 and my sport is breakdancing. I'm Ricky, I'm 23, breakdance as well. Uh, we started when we started in my house, by my house outside on the grass and uh, we sort of helped each other and we developed a style between us. Well, it's taking me off the streets, we're fighting from a rough area, so it's actually took us off the streets to stop us from doing anything. Yeah, it's good fitness as well. Good fitness. Good fitness, health. So you know, it takes well, it stops playing Xbox all day really. Yeah, I lost a lot of weight. I think it's really different. I really like it to be honest. Ooh. I didn't think it's gonna be as good as it did, but to be honest, one of the best events this year we've done. We have made a couple yeah. of new friends, um, met new people we haven't seen before and stuff, yeah. The stand uh, of a twenty twenty four fifth. We yeah. might be getting into them. We came here, we were like, it's going to be just a normal dance event or a little park or whatever. We came here, we were like, everything's here. Everything's here, everyone's happy. Not, it's not like, not everyone's like harsh, tall, everyone's like really friendly. So we've got on with everyone really. Learned different styles from different people. My name is Jacob Peregumella, I'm 24 years old and I train parkour and free running. My background is Jackie Chan movies, pretty much. And then uh, just a lot of martial arts films. My dad was a big Bruce Lee fan. Uh, and from that, I came into Jackie Chan and um, Jet Li and uh, Tony Jaa. Um, and then Jump Britain, Jump London is, uh, I guess, is the big answer from 2003. It's been a big part of my life. It's made me who I am today. It's, um, I never intended it for it to be a career, uh, but now I coach full time. I currently coach 10 classes a week in Somerset and London. Um, and it's, it's the biggest part for me is seeing the guys I teach advance and grow. Um, and seeing I'm giving them uh, the positive mindset to achieve and to uh, not say no to challenge far too early. That's the biggest gain that I get from this. Don't ignore the basics. Um, use YouTube as inspiration, but don't see it as an accurate place for you to start because I think that's where a lot of people are going wrong. They're seeing the guys at the top of their game and neglecting the strength, the, uh, sometimes the conditioning that they've given in, um, and working through the smallest stuff to get to the more technical. Um, and to be creative. It doesn't always have to be A to B efficient. It needs to be fun, it can be fluid. It just needs to be um, enjoyable, and that should be your priority with safety. We saw quite a few different styles, um, some more tripping guys, some more hardcore free running, uh, some uh, more football style. I think it's really, it's really interesting to see how everyone confused together. Uh, the community is definitely there, I think that's the best part um, for me is the community aspect of parkour. It's why I'm here, I'm here for a good time. I'm a t-shirt, not here to win, just here to share memories.